Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're watching for the very first time, hello, my name is Taisha. I go by Namaste on Instagram. So if you're interested in following me on my Instagram, you know, definitely go ahead and do so. I will leave my Instagram name, my Instagram handle on the page. Welcome back if you are a returning subscriber. As you can see by the title of this video, I'm going to be sharing uh, a few pieces that I recently bought from GU. Now, if you don't know, I live in Japan. GU is one of those stores. It's almost like the H&M of Japan. So Uniqlo and GU are, I would say, are the one. Yeah, I would say that they are the leading or one of the leading stores when it comes on to selling clothing that are affordable. Now, if you've watched my previous hauls, and if you haven't already, sis, you need to. After you've watched this, go ahead and watch my Shein haul and my AliExpress haul. I will leave them in the cards above. And um, yeah, so you can definitely go ahead and watch them. In those videos, I have already explained that majority of the clothing items that are sold here are either not my, in my size or they're just not my style. However, if you are in Japan and if you're looking to come to Japan, I would recommend that if you're looking to buy working clothes for, you know, everyday workwear, I would definitely recommend GU and Uniqlo. I personally prefer shopping at GU. It's a little cheaper. They are sister companies. I think they are, if I'm not mistaken, they are owned by the same people. Um, but yeah. So I prefer GU. It's a little on the more affordable side of things. So I like to go there to get my, my, my work clothes. So it's pretty basic and simple. But I wanted to show you guys how I dress to work and some of the pieces that I got for my wardrobe. Because to be honest, I was focusing for the last couple of months on winter clothing because we spent so many months experiencing we had so many months where we experienced um colder weather so now that it's warming up i thought i would get a few pieces that would you know match the weather that we're currently having so i think i've rambled on long enough two minutes in you're here to see the clothes clothing that you're not here for all the talking and all of that nonsense so let me give you what you came for sis if you haven't already like thank you okay so let's get to the first item on oh, disclaimer the very first item that i'm about to show it's not something that i plan on where to work but i got it because it was on sale um so most of the tops that i got were for like 990 yen and uh, that translates to about nine dollars ninety us around ten dollars there about if you're in jamaica it's a little over a thousand dollars um and if you're from somewhere else i don't know how to translate that for you but i'm sure google can help you so the first thing i got is this oversized white thing and this is like an instagram an instagram outfit like an instagram uniform everybody and their grandmother has one of these so i got this on sale it was for 990 yen after um once they had discounted the item so i plan on wearing that out hopefully during my summer vacation if not um it can definitely be worn anytime i plan on going out on a weekend or whenever so it's an oversized top and i'll show you guys in the clips the clips to follow the items that i'm talking about so that you can see how they fit on me so this particular item i plan on wearing it with a turban or something i have an outfit in mind and again if you want to see how your girl Stacia styles her thing you need to follow me on instagram because i'm telling you the content is coming guys and if you have been following me you have been seeing me slowly posting more pictures on the gram so yeah, got that for $9.90 and I think that this kind of piece is a staple. It's multi-purpose in that you can wear it with some jeans, with some shorts, some biker shorts. You can wear it as a skirt if it's not too short. I'm tall so 
I can't get to, I maybe can I can but I wouldn't try to get away with it as a dress but if you're on the shorter side it could be worn as a dress as well you could wear it um, with some nice long jeans some heels some wear it as a dress with some sneakers there are so many ways in which you can style that one piece of clothing that it's an investment worth making and it's not even a big investment so girl it's not that deep it's not that deep. So that's the first item. So let me show you guys the next one. The next item I got is this simple white top. It's a cotton material. Let me show you guys. A cotton material and it's cool and nice and this is also a staple that I think you should definitely have if you are working this can go with so many things you can throw a blazer on with this you can wear it as is you can wear it with a skirt you can wear it with a pants and if you followed me on Instagram you saw that I paired it with one of the items that I will be showing you next um, in the in the next section of this video so I wear this with a lot of things and this color is a staple every woman every man should have something that is in this color with when it comes down to like tops because it is a, a basic that can be used to build into other items and I mean if you want to wear this as a casual top with some jeans and some flats and your handbag and your old running around with some cute earrings like this you can still be cute and bougie on a budget you have to learn how to ball on a budget pandemic or not and i'm here to tell you guys or to show you guys how i do that and hopefully it can inspire you to do the same so i did get the same top in black and i mean it's nothing special it's just black hold on it's not for that right now not right now so i did get it in the black and i mean there's nothing to show it's a black top you know um and this can be worn in a variety of ways also so i got these and both of these each were 900 yen as well so it's a pretty good deal if you ask me and again this is something that can be dressed up or dressed down if you know how to style your outfits and um yeah so this is this So the next piece of clothing that I got, next piece of top that I got, is this very simple top. And normally I would not gravitate to a, a top, well not the top, the color, a color like this. But I've been going through my closet and I have been noticing that I have a, a ton load of black and white. And so I'm trying to diversify my closet. So I'm trying to incorporate more colors in my closet. So I got this top right here. Just a simple top. This was for, if I'm not mistaken, either 500 yen because I do believe I got this one on sale. I got this in the sale section. And um, yeah, so fun fact, if you don't know, if you haven't watched, if you're not an OG, the first place I go when I go into any store is the sale section. I have to see what they have over there and sales section doesn't mean a riffraff guys because if you know business and I mean I'm not off here with business but if you know business once they get a new stock they try to get rid of the old stock and sometimes those old stocks are perfectly good things so go over there girl and learn how to ball on a budget because sometimes the sales section have some gems don't sleep on the sales section girl mm -mm, don't do it you might be missing out so I got this top and this can be worn with a lot of things. I personally would wear it with my black pants or a black pencil skirt that I have already. And I mean, there are other ways to think of. I can't think of any ways right now because it's nighttime and I'm tired and hungry. And sis just wants to take her makeup off and have a glass of wine. So my brain is tired to say the least. And you know what guys, I find myself 
dressing down more than I would if I were in Jamaica because Japan culture is very minimalistic when I tell you minimalistic minimalistic like Japanese people don't overdo things and in the workplace I don't mind toning it down but when I'm stepping out I'm gonna step out as a bad bitch but for work I'll tone it down I'll tone it down I don't mind toning it down the next piece of clothing that I got is this simple top here. Um, it's a simple button top. I think I got this also in the sales section for like 500 yen as well. Um, it's a sweater material. I got it in a size medium and all the items that are, have been shown today were purchased in a size medium. Just in case you're wondering what size am I wearing here. Size medium is usually suitable for me, usually depending on the fabric. Um, this is stretchy, so I could have gotten away with a small or an extra small. Oh, it is a small. So it is a small, and I could have gotten away with an extra small easily. Um, it's one of those tops. I have worn this to work already. Really love how it made me look. Um, I wore it with a work skirt. I don't even know how to describe it to you. It's one of those skirts that has pockets and loops. Does that make sense? yeah it was a work skirt so i wore this to work really liked how it looked um but this is also one of those pieces that can be worn with some jeans some flats or slip sandals and you're quick to go um you're good to go on the road to run errands or whatever it is that you're going to do so this is really comfortable it is in that sweater material and it's really stretchy like i said and i got this in a navy blue just in case just in case you never know oh, oh. so yeah i got that simple it has some silver buttons i personally prefer gold but um it came with silver i don't too mind and yeah that's basically it so i got this black top and it's very simple like i said it has this little detail here and um it's the round sleeve here and it has these very wide arms here um yeah nothing special i got this for 500 yen as well i also got it in the white i'm trying to build back the the basic items needed in a work wardrobe um so yeah i got this and this can be worn with a lot of things you can dress it up and um, wear with some some nice work pants. I would wear them with some work pants. Um, you could also wear them with some pencil skirt or some nice work skirt, just to add some amount of silhouette to it. Um, because this is bigger than usual, and it has the asymmetrical thing here, the high low for both of them. And I think also if you're one of the pregnant women, this is also perfect for you. Um, so yeah, that's, that's, that's that. Like I said, the clothes here are very minimalistic. Um, but for the purposes of work, I don't mind shopping here for that. Uh, so it doesn't bother me to a great extent as long as I can find my size. And as long as they fit, I'm good to go. I'm pretty basic when it comes down to going to work. As long as it's clean, functional, and not too expensive, but durable, I won't complain. I really won't complain. I want to move on into the bottoms, the bottom pieces that I got for for this haul so the first thing i got again i bought the same pants in two different colors and if you're going to come for me understand that i will come back for you so watch your tone and watch your mouth because i don't play those games around here okay so i got this pants in a black and i'm five feet ten 178 centimeters so i honestly don't expect to go into an asian store here to find any sort of pants that's going to fit me to my ankle because if i'm going to be very honest if i were in jamaica i would still have that struggle 
so I don't expect to come here and to find it so I'm not even going to be too pissy about it nor am I, I'm not going to complain because I'm I'm usually touring over everyone in here and I'm pretty tall for for a woman in general so I don't expect to come here and find it so I'm not complaining but I got this here I didn't try this on in the try on portion of the video but I did try on this one right here I bought this because I'm like I said I'm trying to diversify the color scheme in my closet I have a lot of dark colors so I have a lot of black pants blues and stuff like that so I'm like let me get a pastel to brighten up the day you know because on the way to work everyone is in black and gray or blue let me brighten up the place right not only with this pretty face but let me brighten up the place with some some colors so i bought this really cute i wore it with the the sweater looking white top that had i had shown you guys um in the blouse section of the video so i got this and it's really cute really simple like I said, we're not doing the most. We're going there. We make our bread. We go back home. And on the weekends, we turn up. So the last skirt I got was not purchased from GU. It was purchased in H&M. And it's this nice skirt here with the plaid. I wore this with my black sweater blouse that I showed you guys um, in the previous section of this video. So this is fit, fits me well. It's surprisingly bigger than expected. It is a European small. I don't know if that's a US small. It says UK small. Um, so we're going to work with that. It's small, but it, it doesn't fit like a small. I don't mind because I'm not trying to be sexy or anything for work, especially here. So I got this here and I got this 50% off. So I paid 700 yen, I think, before tax. So in, in all, I got 10 pieces of clothing and I didn't spend more than 11,000 yen. So which that's a good thing for me. I did also get a belt um, in the in GU as well that cost 900 yen. It's just one of the regular thin basic work belts that I got because the other two that I had, um, they were signing up for retirement. So I had to retire them and got and I got a new one. Okay guys, if you have made it this far in the video, thank you so much as always for watching my video. If you haven't already, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And you know, it's very free and I don't understand why it's so hard for people to, to show some love. Why? What's wrong? Hmm? What's wrong? Tell me. And before you guys ask, I have already done a little review on this here anyway guys <laughs> thank you so much for watching see you next time in the next video i love you guys so much for your continued support and um bye hey, hey. if i got a land i'ma stick it